Hey guys, we're gonna start heading in. It's gonna start raining. As you can see, weather out here isn't the best. There's big rain clouds in the background there. Never know, tornado may drop down, hopefully not. But you never know with this weather. But we're gonna go on that side, take a good look at some cars. Okay guys, we made it inside the barn. As you can see, there's a variety of vehicles in here and hot rods as well. We got a couple of dragsters, nice cars. Yeah, taking a good look this side. Oh man, you see some nice racers, Corvette, and this purple Chevy with the flames. This car actually had flamethrowers in the back and it blew my mind. I said, this was a purple, nurple, four-door, racer with flamethrowers and they had a poster in there on the back seat showing yeah this thing was a tricked out car with some nice features on it i thought it was pretty neat you know and i usually don't say the word neat i say bad or super bad you know but this thing turned out to be a nice find um one thing though i mean i would love to have seen this thing out there actually running because I want to see how those flamethrowers were and how far back they would throw some fire, you know. Just like anybody else, we love a good show at night with flames. <laughs> yeah, so taking a good look at this buyer guide for you guys, you could get some information right here. Um, but outside of that, this turned out to be a nice find. One thing I did notice was that bottom stripe on the car says Night Stalker. <laughs> Now, if the person was in this car with no real tail lights and they out there chasing down somebody looking at the air, I think it would be pretty menacing to see that hiding around the corner and somebody looking at you in that car and you can't tell who it is with no tail lights, but you see those flames behind it. Yeah, and it's Night Stalker. Yeah, I think this car here would get plenty of bullets put into it with the way people are today. <laughs> Oh, yeah. You want to be a night stalker? Oh, yeah. I got some night stalker ammo for you. Just waiting on you. Well, here we are at the next car. As you see, it's a really nice Mustang. It's a dragster as well. And uh, this thing here, yeah, it turned out to be a really nice car. I thought it was uh, nicely kept for it to be this green color with these this yellowish type paint, two-tone paint. I don't recall. This had to have been after uh, market or, I mean, someone custom painted this with the seats because I never recall this two-tone type of color coming out of Ford. So someone had to redo this car, you know, as they turned it into a dragster. But the thing is, it turned out to be a nice little find here. Nice little stick shift. I do believe that stick shift still. It could be. And why not? I mean, you don't always have to have automatic to be able to drag race. As you can see, when I was trying to do the car review on this, the uh, Country Classic mascot right there happened to come along, gave me a big meow, and then dropped down and went to sleep. <laughs> okay, guys, we got ourselves here a nice little 66 Mustang with a 289 in it. <clears throat> this thing is a nice rebuild, man. It's a four-speed. And this thing is, a, I would say, like a rust color. This thing here is really clean. Beautiful restoration. It's a little tight in here, but we're going to get as much of this car as possible. As you can see, looking at it from the rear, rear bumper, tail lights. This thing is a nice trunk lid, fenders. Driver's side door. We're gonna do the passenger side. Yeah, this car turned out to be a real nice find. This 289 Mustang, man. I do like this rust like color on this car. And more so than others, this one here is a lot more pleasurable to see. This was a very clean Mustang. I will give them that on this restoration. So I would buy this one, you know, and <laughs> stick it right in the garage and have have it out on nice sunny days. No rainy and no wintertime, please. And you look at the inside on the door panel going into the back seat. This was well kept, well restored, 
I, the color scheme for me is a little different. But, yeah, it still turned out nice with that stick shift, man. i take a Mustang any day. Every Good. And it's got the juice. 